doing now is all on the ride, which is recording on the park now. As we go, what about that chip? So it records 100 hours and it tells you, see how it's making a map? It'll make a map. There's some points I, I said I'll do. We're just going to do a little quick Alright guys, it's Nate with Fishing Michiana. I'm back out here with uh, my best fishing buddy here, Mr. Elliot. It's getting better on the camera, I'm getting better. So we are in southwest Michigan. We're fishing a lake called Birch Lake. Uh, we're doing something a little different. It's the heat of the summer, so uh, you know we got two weeks of 90 plus degree water temperature, uh, air temperature. So what we're doing today is we're doing a little night fishing for you. We are going to go after rainbow trout. Spend fishing, we're going to find some deep water, get on the thermal climb, uh, which looks like the thermal climb is around 22 to 23 feet on this lake, according to my pitch climb in here. So uh, we're waiting for this boat traffic to settle down a little bit. Uh, and we're going to get set up here on the 4th of July. So, what do we call this? Independence Day trout fishing? Alright, so stay tuned. Next time you see us, hopefully we'll be hooked up. Talk to you soon. See this right here? That's the thermal climb. Yeah, all the fish are above it. And some of the big, these are, you see some of the little big fish in there, but most of the fish are above it. You see how as we get out deeper, this is about the depth we're going to be fishing, 40 feet. And we're going to be fishing right there at that 25 foot mark. And that's the thermal plant. See all the fish hanging out on the thermal plant. set up in spot one and nothing happened there so we're just going to meander over checking our uh, sonar. Uh, we came out a little bit early and cruised around the lake and looked for some spots and I think we uh, got another mark over here so we're going to check that out and see if we uh, still mark some fish and set up on spot two and see what happens so stay tuned. Oh somebody's got first. Somebody's got first. Oh yeah. Lake Bruiser right there. That's what we all the way down to. Check that out. When you can lip a bluegill, you know it's a real deal. Nice. Yeah, look at that. Looking good. I'll tell you what I need, guys. If anybody's got any tricks out there to get these little hooks out of these bluegills without killing them, put a comment below. I hate killing these things, but man, look at that tank. Nice blue go. Let's see what else we can do. And by the way, that's first. Look at that, another fatty. Another nice gill out here. Got a nice blue gill. Well, no, because I have the first and the biggest. But we are tied for most. Alright, so we're going to switch up tactics here. Because we've been out here for oh, a good couple hours and we've yet to get a trout so what we are getting is some tank bluegills so we're gonna move up a little bit closer here switch some bobbers and some straight line techniques let's see if we get some of these big old gills in there because these are some nice bluegills so and we're tied one to one my bass came off but we'll see what happens i'm gonna show you what i'm doing here now i'm kicking your ass yeah, another fish on. Another big old gill. Looks like it. Looks like another big old fatty blue gill. Look at that. Look at that thing. Jeez. This tank out. Anti blue gill. My son effectively. Um,
perfect for cut bait. You know what you got there? That is a green sunfish, and that is a flathead killer right there. You put that live on a hook, flathead killer. That's what that is. Awesome, now. Easy. We got that. All right. Well, we uh, just finishing up our trip out here on Birch Lake. Uh, the trout didn't cooperate today, uh, but we did uh, manage to find some fish. We got some bluegills in the boat, got some bass, some green sunfish, and uh, all together we had a good time. So uh, I enjoy Fourth of July with Elliot out on the lake. And uh, anything you want to say to everybody before we call tonight? Uh, don't stay up past me. Don't stay up past midnight. All right, talk to you guys soon. Bye.